How's it going everybody? It's Gorilla Man here back with another car mechanics in 2021 video and in today's video guys I got another part of the Ford DLC not this Ferrari uh, Actually, I should say I have two parts of the Ford DLC uh, I found in the junkyard number one would be The f-350 that is right. I found an f-350 in the junkyard it took about uh, I'd probably say 25 junkyard runs somewhere around there so f-350 super duty. I think it has the rear wheel boss motor in it yeah uh i can switch it out for the coyote just normal v8 or the supercharge honestly i think we're gonna switch it out for the supercharger i think i want more power in this thing uh we're definitely gonna get it uh as lifted with big tires as i can i don't think i can really lift it lift it and then uh out front here there's our our gt40 from last episode looking as mint as ever we also grabbed a 2017 Ford Mustang, uh, the DLC one as well. I think this one had the supercharger in it, right? Oh, no, this one had the Coyote motor, our Coyote motor. Uh, nice blue, though. I really like the blue. I might keep that color, but this one's just going to sit outside in the rain for a bit. Uh, the dust for a bit, actually. And we're going to work on the F-350. So first things first, just so we can see what we're working with. Going to the car wash we're gonna get outside cleaned inside cleaned uh inside's gonna have to be taken out anyways and completely trash because we're missing missing some windows let's get the remaining carpet cleaned oh wait actually this thing doesn't even have any seats in it all right so i bought it for 12. i guess it's already got a little bit of a little bit of profit on it but I bought it for around 11.8 so keep that in mind when I get it up to hopefully like 150,000 by the end of uh this little episode or series actually uh let's go back to the lift first things first as per usual let's get the motor out of here this is rear wheel drive so I think it shouldn't be too difficult Where are we at? All right, drop the drive shaft. Come on, there we go. I don't know if I switch it out to the supercharged, if it'll be front wheel or all wheel. I don't, I don't really know. I hope it'll turn into four by four though. All right, there we go. That's done. Drop that down while that lowers. Oh, and I also, I guess I never noticed in the updates for the game that they added a window tinting kit. So I was going through the toolboxes earlier and I was like, hmm, make sure I have everything in here. And then I realized I was missing this down here. Uh, I still don't have all of this stuff in here, but that's fine. It's I really want to improve, I think, mounting speed next. Screwing speed's pretty quick, but mounting speed could use a lot of points spent in it. All right, should be able to pop that bad boy out. See what kind of condition it's in. Oh, V8, double overhead cam supercharged. Maybe we could just slap that bad boy in. Wait, what does this want? V8 double overhead supercharged okay well I might actually have a fully complete supercharged motor I do okay or the boss I think I want the supercharger in there uh, I don't think it has performance parts on it though so I might have to uh disassemble this and throw some performance parts on it let me see actually no this thing is this thing is complete performance it's got the full package on oh okay that saves me some time and effort that's incredible uh i'm gonna pull off all this stuff really quick i'm gonna get the all the body panels back to where they need to be and then i'll throw on or throw in the motor if i got a rusty body then it's not would not take well. Let's 
take this. Whoosh. 350 steering wheel. Fenders come off. No running boards. They stay on. All right, let's see what it looks like now. Body zero. Let's see what type of repairs I can do. I'm just going to repair this stuff just to save a few extra coins here. But I'm going to also see if there's any aftermarket parts I can put on this stuff. There we go. Oh, nice. Nice, I made it the entire way without breaking any of those. Uh, there's my, wait. What am I clicking on that? All right, let's get the welder going. Magically fix the body. Love to see that. Next up, let's see. Do we have a battery in here anywhere? No, I don't, okay. Well, since I got everything off, I'm going to put this motor in. Keep it a little bit easier. Uh, let's see. Interior. I thought it would take me back when I do this. Body tuning. Anything in here? Anything in here? Nope. No bo only body tuning for those. Alrighty. No add-ons. Scoop, maybe, but not for ours. All right, it's gotta be. Go in here and grab everything. So we got the cream seats, not my favorite. I like the dark, not dark, but the cognac colored ones. Those are my favorites. But this is what they want me to do. This is what I will do for now. Maybe I'll switch it out. Oh, yeah, I don't know about the color of these seats. Let me check. What, what type of seats did they, did they take? It takes a bench and just a front seat. Honestly, I might see if I can just get the earthquake ones in there. I like these seats as well. The wheel can stay. Okay, let's see if I can swap these real quick. I can. Yeah, I would much rather have that than the uh, than the cream. Especially since I'm probably going to do this like a dark gray. Or, dang it. Dark gray or something, but... Okay, so I need like an actual full bench seat. Alright, let's look for a different bench. Uh, let's try the... Let's try this one, or this one, or this one, or this one, or this one. One of these is going to work. And if none of those work, uh, I may no bench. May not, yep, yep. All right, so we're going to do no bench in the back. We're going to say strictly storage. I uh, just really don't want to throw the cream seats in there. And let's see what parts I managed to save. I don't think I saved too much. Oh, I do have a hood. Bumper, let me see here. Okay, it looks like all of this is pretty much stock. Didn't have any lights. Don't have any side mirrors. I know I'm still missing some stuff, but I'm just grabbing, trying to grab everything in one fell swoop. Mirrors. And then I'm... Oh. I might try tinting the rear windows. Uh, that's legal here in Iowa. You can tint the rear windows as much as you want. But... I don't know. I don't think you can on the other stuff. Okay. So that one, <clears throat> that one will have to be painted. Too bad I can't get a truck bed. All right, Does it actually have a low. Uh, it kind of has a liner in it already. Uh, bumper. 
Tailgate, tailgate, tailgate. There we are. Oh, I have two doors. That I don't know how I have two doors, but I do. Missing front left fender. Is that it? It's front left fender. Back. Front left fender. And then also, while I'm in here, let's snag some Iowa plates. So if we're talking about Iowa, we'll run with Iowa. Two of these. Uh, okay, I'm going to try and let's spell this out quickly. Got to admit, I don't like how you can't type in anymore. This is an F-350. We're going to set it to all in. Two of those. Make sure I buy those. Let me return the grain back to the shop side. All right. So now we have a full new motor, body done. Look at that. That's already looking real good. It is missing the... It is going to be missing that bench, so it might affect my total price in the end, but... At this point, I'll I'll take it. Hmm. Yeah, we'll we'll, we'll we'll leave it like that. All right, there's still a lot more work to be done. Let's move this thing over to the paint shop, though. Now, since I have all that done, so switch over to the paint shop and try and figure out what. Whoa, that is a that is a bright color. So I'm a big proponent of the tans. So the factory colors that they have in here. Where is this at? Factory colors. I love this. I, I think this one's incredible. Really like this one. Maybe a little too dark. Blue's great, obviously. Maybe a little too dark on the blue. Gloss versus metallic. I probably want to try that color. Hmm. I want to do this color, but change the paint type. Then it changes it immediately. Gloss seems better than metallic. Yeah, metallic's just too metally. All right, so that should change the color. Okay, that that definitely does do it. Hmm. Let's see here. Get me wrong the blues are good but i think we're gonna do go something else for the blues also the greens are cool that's kind of a cute green hmm maybe i just go a classic silver just a nice classic silver color here let me see do we have any libraries oh we do okay so one we got stripes okay so that's the best we got is we got stripes honestly the black stripes on the gray body pretty good we'll we'll, we'll run with that nice very nice Make sure everything looks good. All right. Well, we're going to end the video here, guys. In the next video, I'm going to be tinting windows, getting everything uh, done on the undercarriage, exhaust, the wheels, uh, full the wheel setup, and then we will uh, take it, dyno it, tune it, test it, see how much horsepower I can get out of it. I did put a new motor in it, so it does have a supercharged motor, so it should be pulling a lot more of some performance parts. Not too sure, though, but hopefully... Hopefully we are. So thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like, comment down below, and I'll see you guys in the next Car Mechanic Sim video.